Hello, and welcome to a Filipina in a foreign land. It's Wednesday, the 18th of June. Anyway, I was trying to get Philip, but he keeps moving around on me, behind me. Oh, well, we got some kind of bad news, I guess. Dinghy fever. Eileen's two of her boys are in the hospital in Magawe. I, I'm, I'm not sure how to say that name of that town where they live at. Uh... They're both hooked up to IVs. <coughs> They're in the hospital there. And so hopefully they're on the mend. Her oldest son has lost quite a bit of weight and as well as her other son. So we'll see what happens, but I'm sure they'll be okay. But that's a part of being in the Philippines, I guess, dinghy fever. At least it could have been a lot worse, I guess. I was trying to get a hold of Philip here this morning. There's Philip. He's being Philip this morning. So, other than that, hopefully the insurance people will get a hold of me today. They didn't call yesterday, other than saying they called to said they were they called and said they were going to call, which is just absolutely freaking crazy. So it's been almost four weeks. Almost four weeks. My God, I'm glad I wasn't injured in the damn thing. I've been laying there in the hospital four weeks saying, oh, I don't know if we can treat him yet or not, dumbasses. Anyway, trying to get Philip. He won't cooperate. So this is Filipina in a foreign land. There's Philip. Give us a thumbs up. Please subscribe. And thanks for watching. I'll keep everybody posted on the dinghy fever situation as well as the insurance as well as any new developments with Philip, which I doubt if there will be any. So everybody take care. Have a good day. Thanks for watching. Bye now.